too often because you have to drive the tram and I'm scared of heights but there's a really good exhibit going on right now the Baroque paintings and I'm really interested to look in there and see I am kind of inspired by older paintings and and artists and their technique the symbolism involved I guess I have similarities that way I use a lot of symbolism in my work but I'm a pretty introverted person and I feel like my art is an outlet. It's my way of expressing my voice and sort of sharing a, a positive, positive energy and positive thought.
Passionate Ops. Uh, the piece comes from 5150, the term for uh, honorable discharge for being crazy. So it's basically like, she's crazy, I guess. <laughs> Jason Maloney, I'm from Hurley, and we're here with Nathan Spore. Nathan? Jason. Take us through this piece. Uh, this is my latest piece, This Immaculate Correspondence. And uh, basically, it's a male-centric, like, my, my work typically has a male or female feel to it. And this is definitely more male. We got candy, we got drugs. Right. We got little animals on a carousel. Yeah, we have all different layers of, of special things that a young boy Contemporary life, we have it. Right, in contemporary everyday life. Uh, you know, you've got the, the child, like the Candyland Trail, you know, representing where the young boy would, would travel, you know, to get to the more experienced uh, realm here where he's got the prescription and all kinds of different. Uh, well, I guess the drugs would represent um, information, perhaps, or, or ways of accessing, you know, ingesting information. Turning certain parts on and turning certain parts off. support system and what she's doing this is kind of a young tree as old as a tree can be it's still fairly young and uh, these portions here represent uh, channels where things can come and go uh, generally takes like this piece I worked on over several months I worked on several paintings at one time that's awesome thanks Nathan thanks and there you have it Nathan's board